How's it going guys? Tyrant here and I just finished watching the latest episode of Black Clover and we're taking kind of a little bit of a, a lighter note after the whole big commotion that happened recently and uh, it's time for a mixer and yeah I can't remember the guy who does the, the spectral magic name so he's just gonna be the guy who uses spectral magic up the, for now until I remember his name because um at, at the beginning he's trying to figure out who he should bring to the mixer since it's three girls and three guys and um, he's already bringing Asta since he's kind of the normalish one I would say and then um, then you get a whole bunch of uh, uh, this little compilation of him trying to figure out who he's gonna get to come to the mixer and stuff and at the end it kind of boils down to luck uh, I've always forget that there's that one shy guy that can barely talk and he's like oh it's just whispering what did you do? but yeah uh, on top of that uh, we get uh, Noel sneaking in uh, behind them and trying to keep an eye and wondering what's happening being her she, yeah, she's a Sundre, so yeah. Uh, so she's like meddling a little bit, but just kind of spying, not really doing anything, but just, it's really fun. She literally gets a job as a waitress at the restaurant. They're having the mixer to spy on them. And um, for the most part, it gets it gets a little cringy. Uh, just, I'm not going to lie. Um, you know, they do their introductions and... Uh, God, I can't remember the spectrum guy's name, but anyways, he does the he does his charm thing. He gets the girls flowers. And they're like, okay, okay. And then Luck and Asa kind of sour it up a little bit, I would say. Um, but it's normal when you're kind of nervous and kind of like. So it's funny to see that, um, and uh, a, a different light, just kind of moving away from all this action-packed stuff. It's just fun just to kind of see a little light humor and. Uh, a little character uh, build, um, and uh, for the most part, the the mixer turns out a little good. Um, uh, Luck somehow is able to talk with the uh, the hairdresser girl, and she kind of like oh, uh, t magic talk shit, and it's like okay, that's working. Um, the spectral dude somehow ends up um, talking with the the shoot, what's her name? I can't remember her name, but the the girl who's the uh, uh, dress designer or some shit like that uh you know like yeah like she's like thinking eh. it's funny is that the, when the girls are all thinking the same thing even though they're not talking like eh, you know uh, i don't know about these guys they might be magic knights but still like eh. um but at, at the end um it ends up asta with this one girl uh this redhead um and it gets that's where it gets like really awkward he's like eh, damn um but then what's what's good what's interesting is this is a mixer and you have to try to you know get to know someone during one of these things and uh yeah we actually get something out of this um uh asta uh ends up um actually conversing like a normal person about you know their family and how she has siblings he has siblings and like, you know how they grew up and stuff like that and it's really like something normal and, and it's really fun to see uh, uh then this gentleman comes around being a dick uh and kind of asa just like literally chucks him to a group and that one guy the i can't remember his name but literally he, the guy goes uh is there on a mixer with his buddies Oh god, that's gone sour in the beginning. Um, so, so just seeing, um, just seeing, uh, uh, Asta kind of showcase himself, and another girl actually seeing some interest in him uh, surprised me because we do have that other girl who does the the plant magic stuff. Oh, who's also interested in him uh but there's like another girl who i would say is slightly more similar uh and uh 
can kind of, you know, they have the same level, and it's like really interesting that just that came out of nowhere. And it makes more sense because she's she's the more well if you if you go back and watch it and you look at their character design she's the most detailed character from all three of them um uh, yeah yeah but it kind of ends with uh with uh everyone not getting a date it kind of also is the only one that kind of got could have got a date out of it the only thing is that one he doesn't know what a mixer's for Two, I I don't know how I forgot this, but he already has someone he wants to marry. It's the sister, and so yeah, I can I I don't know why I forgot that. That was a joke, not a joke, but it's something that's literally been said. And yeah, yeah. So that's gonna be it um for this episode. It was a fun episode, a good translation. Uh, in transition, I mean, from just all this acting, uh, just kind of giving us a, a fun episode, giving us a different light on people and stuff like that. Uh, one thing I will, will like to end with is that towards the end, when he was gonna say who he liked, um, Noel overheard him and he was interrupted. So he now she has this feeling that it might be her that she likes and stuff like that i don't know it's gonna it's gonna be interesting um uh, from here so yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna finish up there so yeah fun episode fun episode so thanks again for watching until next time see you